Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you God for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so we start the week with the Five of Cups. Okay, Suffering great loss, uh, grief, feeling like something was taken from you, uh, the collapse of a relationship, wanting or longing for, you know, to be reunited. Either this is you, Aries, or this is someone else you're dealing with. It could be a Scorpio. Um, there's a lot that keeps you and this person apart. It also could be distance, you know, physical distance, or it could just be distance of the heart. Um, I think you kind of have to cut your losses here and let bygones be bygones with the two of cups back here. The ten of swords is the advice. Um, this is the fullness of the connection. This is what you get. When something is full, it's full, right? You go to a restaurant, a uh, nightclub, anywhere, and they say we're full to capacity. That, that means nothing you know, um, no one's coming out because they're full and uh, no one's coming in. So it's nothing more to be had in this connection. It is what it is. What you see is what you're getting. What you feel is what it is. Um, you need to deal with this. There's like a collapse here, you know, of a maybe even devastation. Um, this could be that somebody lost a job or someone is losing a job. If someone is um, trying to deal with uh, maybe a divorce, a separation, a breakup, or a breakdown in a connection here. Um, with the Six of Cups here, it wants you to, the Six of Cups being the outcome is you need to connect backwards. It talks about ancestry and rootedness. What are you rooted to? If nothing, then that might be something to explore also. You might need to explore your family relationships. Um, it's about finding balance and harmony uh, by way of knowing that you're in an environment where you can be yourself, uh, that you feel comfortable in, that you, you feel a, a sense of usefulness, of service to. Some of you could um, have never felt comfortable within your family dynamic. You could still be in love with someone. Um, it's like an old flame or someone that you met in your your youth. Yeah, in your youthful years or college or hometown sweetheart. Somebody that you have a significant past with. I don't know if, if it's hard for them with the Six of Cups to get over you or vice versa. But but this is over. This is done. You know, you, you can't get anything else out of this um this whole situation could be happening again because you need to um learn to move on um some of you maybe you feel like you're suffering great loss with maybe not getting what you wanted out of this dynamic or vice versa someone else feels this way um you have to rationalize um this this moving on also, it looks like once you decide to move on, once you decide um, that this isn't for you, relief from hardships can, you know, um, come for you. Some of you had to move on in silence, okay? But it's about moving on from the heart, the heartache of, of some previous relationship, maybe even healing from an abusive partner or childhood issues trauma healing 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 moving on and things will calm down for you relief you know for some of you the only way to fix this problem is to leave it and move on you can't even okay, moving on and healing is like the um the theme of this reading you know is to leave it alone move on and start something new you have to plot a new course to your happiness because this course that you you had is not working out so you need to plan 
use logic and clarity okay and that's going to ensure that you have success in love career finances whatever but you need to leave that that part of yourself um that part that is self-sabotaging um you need to leave that behind and you need to heal from your old wounds you haven't healed from old wounds but you're trying to go into new situations or relationships the reason why all of this is happening is because there needs to be a level of maturing or maturity happening for you or someone else involved or the both of you um this is what i have for you this week aries if it resonates for you go over to the website book your own reading there take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you aries many blessings to you take care